Hello, hello and welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to have a look at how to inspect diodes on your alternator rectifier. Rectifier diodes are there in order to convert the AC that is coming out of the stator winding to DC. So they are like a single one directional switch, one directional passage that will allow AC to be converted to DC. Now, in order to inspect diode, right here you can see three diodes attached to a heat sink. So one terminal will be on the heatsink and the other terminal will be right here. For this test, you need a multimeter that can measure diode continuity. Put it on the diode mark. Right there, there is a diode mark. And once that is selected, you can see a diode indicating on the screen of the multimeter. And once you select it on that, then the diode should provide continuity only in one direction and it should not be providing continuity in the other direction. Now. When the multimeter is reading this value, as you can see, there is no continuity. Let's go ahead and measure the well-being of this diode, for example. Place one on the heat sink and press the other right here. It is reading a still open circuit. And let's flip the multimeter terminal, change the polarity of the terminals, and measure, resist, measure the diode. Now we are finding 410 millivolt that indicates this diode is working nice. What about this? This is also nice. So this is also nice. So a diode should provide you continuity only in one direction. If you flip, you should not be receiving continuity. If the diode is giving you continuity in both direction, it means the diode is shorted out. If it provides no continuity in either direction, that indicates the diode is open. Similar tests can be done for rectifier diodes. For any diode, for that matter, you can do a similar test. Let's test this diode, for example. One terminal can be placed on the heat sink. The other terminal can be placed here. See, we have continuity. And when you flip, there should be no continuity. There is no continuity right here. This indicates this diode is functional. There is another diode here. Let's go ahead and measure. Place one multimeter on the heatsink and one on the diode terminal. Flip the multimeter and do the same test. Now, as you can see, the diode is now functional. So this is how you can measure the diode on your alternator rectifier. These rectifiers have diodes. Basically, there are six rectifier diodes on every alternator. So you can test the alternator rectifier diode by using a multimeter in such a fashion.